So in this video, we're going to show you how to put the antenna on spout. Now this requires a fair amount of precision, so we want to be really careful uh, when we put the hot glue on. But what we've done is we've bent a paper clip out, and you can tell there's a straight side to the paper clip, and we want to leave one of those sides uh, completely straight, but we're going to bend out the rest of the paper clip and try and get rid of as many of the kinks as we can. But it's important to leave that, that side, the last little bit, uh, straight and, and not bend it because uh, it'll make it a lot easier to connect. So it should look about like this when you get done. So we're going to take our spout bot, we're going to turn it on its side. If you have a partner, they can hold it for you. Otherwise, a roll of tape works well. And you want to make sure that that antenna uh, points straight down. And we're going to try and line it up on the switch. So we're going to put the, uh, the paper clip, the straight, sm smooth, flat part of the paper clip on the switch. And so we're going to hot glue it in place. And it's, it's easy to get too much or too little hot glue on this. So you want to make sure there's enough hot glue to completely cover the paper clip on both sides, but no more. Because if you spill hot glue over it, it'll stick on the switch and the switch won't work properly. So you'll need to make sure that it's held in place tightly. And you'll have to hold it for a little while until the glue turns uh, opaque or that milky color and is completely cool. And then you'll be ready to uh, do the other side the exact same way and you'll have antenna on your bot. Okay, once you get both of the antennas done, you're gonna to wanna to test it out and see how it runs. I'll leave the LEDs off for now just to see, because we're just interested in, in looking at uh, how well the bot runs and what it does. So you can see it moves okay, sort of bumps into things and backs up a little bit, uh, but I think there's probably a way we can optimize it and make it run a little bit better.